lot more womanly when you let your hair down. I followed you from work and the door won't lock. I've been reading your articles in the Herald. You do a great job, considering you're under the strictures of reporting just a fact. Oh, I'm not criticizing. I just, what with all the foreclosures and woes of the stock market, it seems like people could stand a little less black and white trip and a skosh more from being entertained. What are you doing here? I'm just a fan. Oh, I gotta say, I was surprised when I found out PJ was a woman. You always called yourself PJ? Or was that your boss's idea? Stop your readers from finding out you're a Patricia. <laughs> Maybe it's just me, but it seems like things are really moving forward for our gender. What with that Amelia Earhart fixing to fly across the Atlantic, and you in the newsroom writing about crime, and me out there committing them. I couldn't help but notice. You only put Clyde's name down. Nice of you to mention me only as female companion. It wasn't my idea. My editor said if a girl was involved in an armed robbery, it had to be because her man was making her do it. Really? <laughs> Imagine that. Would you please get out of my house? Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> Sorry. Oh, goodness, PJ, I never introduced myself. I'm Bonnie Parker. Ally Bonnie. 